afternoon. Welcome to the Henry E. Harris Class of 2023 graduation. Will the audience please remain standing? We will now pay honor and respect due to the flag of our country. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Star Spangled Banner. Thank you. Please be seated. Good evening and welcome. Bayonne Board of Education Trustee Sam Maggio, Assistant Business Administrator and former Henry Harris Principal Tom Fogu, Assistant Principal Louisa Jaros, Henry Harris staff, parents, guests, and most of all, the graduating class of 2023. Today is a momentous occasion as we gather here to celebrate the remarkable journey of our eighth grade students. As the principal of Henry Harris School, it brings me great joy and pride to stand before you today and honor these individuals who have grown, learned, and thrived within our halls. Graduation is a milestone that signifies the end of one chapter, yet the beginning of another. It is a time for reflection, gratitude, and anticipation for the adventures that lie ahead. Today, we honor the hard work, the dedication, and the perseverance that have led these students to this pivotal moment in their lives. To the parents and guardians who have supported and nurtured these young minds, we express our deepest appreciation. Your unwavering commitment to their education, their emotional well-being, and personal growth has certainly laid the foundation for their success. Your sacrifices and encouragement have propelled them forward, and today, we celebrate your role as their guiding force behind their accomplishments. To the remarkable faculty and staff, your passion, your knowledge, your unwavering commitment to education has made a profound impact on our students' lives. You have cultivated an environment where curiosity thrived, where minds expanded, and where dreams were born. Your dedication to shaping these young individuals into critical thinkers, compassionate citizens, and lifelong learners is truly commendable. And to the graduates, our shining stars, today is your day. You have come a long way since your first timid steps into Henry Harris School. Over the years, you have grown academically and personally, discovering your unique talents, interests, and aspirations. You have overcome challenges, embraced new experiences, and developed the skills necessary to navigate the world 
beyond the Henry Harris walls. Remember that this moment is not an end, but a beginning, a beginning filled with boundless opportunities, uncharted territories, and infinite possibilities. Embrace this transition with open hearts and open minds, for the world is waiting for your contributions. Graduates, the road ahead may be uncertain, but have faith in your abilities, trust in your instincts, and never, never lose sight of your dreams. As you embark on this new chapter, embrace the power of resilience and adaptability, for they will guide you through life's inevitable changes. And as you leave Henry Harris, always, always carry with you the memories, the friendships, the lessons of your time here, and know that you are capable of extraordinary things. You, each of you, possess the power to shape the world, to inspire change, and to leave an indelible mark on the lives of those around you. Dream big, Henry Harris Hawks, and congratulations to the Henry E. Harris Class of 2023. At this time, please join me in welcoming Assistant Principal Jaros to assist with the presentation of the mayoral proclamations for our salutatorian and valedictorian. The salutatorian is the student with the second highest average of the graduating class. It is my honor to announce Henry E. Harris's class of 2023 salutatorian is Allison Vivian Morell. The valedictorian is the student with the highest average of the graduating class. It is my honor to announce Henry E. Harris's class of 2023 valedictorian is Ryan Francis Alexander Neal. Please welcome our valedictorian, Ryan Neal. Good afternoon. I would like to begin by thanking Principal Kasmer, Assistant Principal Jaros, Trustee Maggio, as, uh, as the Assistant School Business Administrator Fogu, as well as the amazing faculty and teachers that have given me the chance to be here today as the valedictorian for the class of 2023. Throughout the past 10 years I've spent at this school, I've not only learned many lessons, but also created many great friendships. Long ago in pre-K, while others just this year, I would argue the memories we have made together at Henry Harris are huge factors in our lives. This is because they got us to where we are today. We, not only as a class, but as friends, work together to get through one of the largest historical events this century. The global pandemic COVID-19 caused us to work together and find new ways not only to learn, but to live. Not being able to meet up with friends caused us to find new creative ways to talk and made us adapt to a whole new world and make memories unlike any others. One of my favorite memories from this time was when we originally thought it would only last around two weeks. Although these two weeks turned out to last much longer, this just made returning to Henry Harris and seeing my friends and teacher in person again, something I'll never forget. This formative event taught us not to take the simple things for granted. And being back here today has taught us that even when times are tough, it is temporary. Hard work will always prevail. One quote that I've heard and now live by is that success is not final, failure is not fatal, but it is the courage to go on that counts. This quote is one that I and many of us in the class of 2023 have used many times, not only through COVID, but for the rest of the time we spent here. From hard tests, essays, and projects, 
we learn that one success does not mean you are set for life, and one bad test doesn't mean you're going to fail. In the end, there is always more to come. So if I could give some advice to the class of 2023, it would be to live life to the fullest, learn from your mistakes, and have as much fun as possible. Live life to the fullest by trying new things in high school and pushing yourself to achieve any goal you set your mind to. You're going to make mistakes. We all are. But it is important to learn your lesson and keep moving on. Finally, have fun. Make new friends. Join a club. Be play sports. Because if it's anything like our time at Henry Harris, high school will go by quickly. On behalf of the class of 2023, I would like to thank all of our teachers, parents, guardians, and family family members for helping us reach this major milestone in our lives. And to the class of 2023, thank you for the great times and congratulations. for the presentation of awards. 
For decades, the Bayonne Rotary Club has been a presence in our community. Each year, the Rotary Club sponsors our Citizenship Award, which is given to the graduating student in every school. These students who exemplify the characteristics of citizenship and respect serve as positive role models to their peers. The Rotary Citizenship Award is presented to the student who has been most outstanding in service to their school. The recipient of the 2023 Bayonne Rotary Citizenship Award is Talia Omara Smith. And now for the subject awards. Students, please stand to be acknowledged for your award. Recipient of the Bayonne Education Foundation Student Leadership Award goes to Louis Geraldo. <laughs> Recipient of the Language Arts Literacy Award is Pito H. Mantilla. We have two recipients for the math award. First recipient is Philip Atier B. Farag. Our next recipient of the math award is Ryan Francis Alexander Neal. Recipient of the Science Award is Ella Grace Janeco. Recipient of the Social Studies Award is George Edwin Silva. Recipient of the Physical Education Award is Christian Thomas Hayes. Recipient of the Art Award is Sophia Isabella Milikowski. Recipient of the Technology Award is Kadar J. Hall. Recipient of the Music Award is Samantha Safara Navarro. Congratulations to all of our award recipients. The President's Award for Educational Excellence, as noted by the gold cords being worn tonight, are awarded to the students who have achieved high honors in all major subject averages and who also demonstrate high motivation, initiative, integrity, and leadership qualities. Parents, we need your cooperation. We ask that you please hold your applause until all recipient names have been announced. Our 2023 President's Award recipients are Marina Saad Abul Saad, Adriel, Adriel Bryce Calicio, Jedie Kanadi Samara Javier Diestro, Philip Atier B. Farag, Miriam Gurgis, Mark William Gouda, Ella. So parents, each child deserves the opportunity as well as their parents to hear their names called. So please, we ask for your cooperation. Thank you. Ella Grace Gineco, Irene E. Caldis, P. 
Pedo H. Mantilla, Jillian Marie Mateo, Allison Vivian Morell, Ryan Francis Alexander Neal, Jason Henry Oliveira, Chris, Crystal Deja Sasso, Talia Omara Smith. And now for the moment that you have all been waiting for, presentation of diplomas. Please join me in welcoming Bayonne Board of Education Trustee Sam Maggio and Assistant School Business Administrator Tom Fogu to assist with the distribution of diplomas. So parents, once again, I promise you, we will give you enough time to cheer, but every child and their family member deserves the right to hear their name. So at the end of each row, I'll let you cheer all you want, but please just wait and hold your applause till the last uh, student in the row has been called. Isaiah N. Estevez, Chloe A. Perez, Crystal Deja Sasso, Jaslyn Marinell Donovan, Genesis Poza, Anasha Eileen Melendez, Brooke Leanne Pelicane, Irene E. Caldas. Barbara Gabriela Mendez, Jillian Marie Mateo, Alexis Irene Rivera, Marion N. Gurgis, Madi Borif, Gracelyn E. Jose, Christian G. Quintuna Uchapelli, Tatiana Marie Dumbaya. Jessica M. Farris, Sophia Isabella Milikowski, Julia A. Iskander, Thomas J. Plaskin, Philippeteer B. Farag, Patrick J. Plaskin, Jedie Kanadi Samara Javier Diestro, George Edwin Silva, Amanda Marie Hitlin Olson.
Daniela A. Fosse Morales, Mariel Tawadros, Landon C. Garcia, Ethan Cruz, Heleni Encarnacion, Talon James Carr, Anna Simone A. Anna Simone A. Solomon, Krishana K. Earl. Luis Geraldo, Zaid Masi, Jada Serenity Rickens, Addison Lisa Serrano, Jaya W. Wolfolk, Caleb Ethan Cal, Ahmed Mergani Taha, Junia N. Bashut. Orlando Ramos Jr. Leah Elizabeth Leah Elizabeth McAlary Jalen C. Parker Mark William Gouda Destiny Liliana Alisea Chloe Fernandez Naraya May Hall Casey M. Lapresti Christopher Nelson Gonzalez, Larod J. Miller Jr., L Liam Marinus O'Rourke, Juan Luis Geraldo Mesquita, Nino Robert Burke, Darren Joseph Burke Jr., Adriel Bryce Caliccio, Glenn M. Serduk, Melvin E. Bueno Jr., Sebastian De Jesus, 
Sebastian De Jesus Garcia Geraldo, Samantha Safaro Navarro, Kadar J. Hall, Marquise T. Rouse. Ryan Francis Alexander Neal, Derek N. Gomez, Elijah M. Ramirez, Pedro, Pedro Yusef Rezik, Christina Isabella Cachola, Marina Saad Abusad. Ivan Bravo, Mateo Z. Garcia, Madi Chabubi, Sadan S. Smith Lester, Michael Joel III Lewis Jr., Jaden I. Coto. Pito H. Mantilla, Talia Omara Smith, Moises Q. Batara Jr., Imad Dadun, Angelisa Winnie Longa, Victor I. Sabalos Mauricio, Jada E. Murray, Christian Thomas Hayes. Allison Vivian Morell, Juan Lewis Mercedes, Mira A. Strickland, Daniel Elijah Castano, Ella Grace Gineco, Jason Henry Oliveira, Philippeteer E. Ibid.
As principal of Henry E. Harris School, it is my honor and privilege to present to you the Henry E. Harris graduating class of 2023. Congratulations to all of our parents as well. This does conclude our pa program. Parents, the graduates will now make their way out through the front of the building and over to the 30th Street side. The street is closed off. Plenty of photo opportunities. Once again, congratulations to the class of 2023.